Hey guys and welcome back to the Coder's Legacy channel. In today's video we're going to discuss something pretty short but pretty interesting. So whenever we have a taken care window, we have an entire layout set up, right? We have something to the left, we have columns, a grid, and a bunch of widgets carefully positioned, right? So what can happen is that the user, when resizing it, the layout can get pretty messed up. So what we sometimes do is disable resizing like root dot resizable, then we pass in false for the x-axis and false for, false for the y-axis and disable resizing completely. But this isn't always a very great idea. Disable resizing outright is not very user friendly, if you ask me. What you can do instead is set a minimum width and height and a maximum width and height. So for example, if you think that beyond a certain threshold your your layout becomes bad or like if the user resizes it down too much beyond a certain point it just becomes way too cramped or they begin overlapping with each other then what you can do is specify a min size okay like 300 by 300 if you're not comfortable with the user resizing it down this point then you can do this 300 in the X and 300 in the Y. And let's just change this to 200, just to keep it a bit different. Okay, hold on. And let's run this. And let me show you. So I can resize this as much as I want to when it comes to making it big. But when it comes to making it small, I get blocked at this point. And the interesting thing is that even if you use root.geometry, to, you know, this is a very popular way of setting the width. So whenever you do this, oh wait, oh, sorry, I made it bigger. We need to make it smaller. So this is still 300 by 200, okay? So basically that's the thing. Even root.geometry is not gonna work. Explicitly setting the width and height is not gonna work. Min size is that thorough. And also interestingly, one more thing, is that min size makes sure that the, that the window starts out with this size if the window is smaller. Like if your window is uh, by default, like there aren't many widgets inside of it maybe, or at least during development, like let's say that you're taking your window by default, what does it look like when there's no widgets? It looks like this. So when you do a min size, min size basically ensures that it starts out with at least that's this much size okay and then obviously there's root dot max size which you can do to make sure your user doesn't get too crazy with how big he makes it so i can increase it to this point okay and that's about it can't go beyond this see pretty interesting right so yeah hope you enjoyed this video if you want to see more content like this in the future make sure to subscribe to the channel leave a like leave a comment let me know what you thought and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye then.